Hello friends, in this part, we will discuss, how to display particular user all followers on single page, in this follow unfollow system by using PHP. In previous, part we have seen how to display particular user all post on single page, in this follow unfollow system. For display all followers of particular user, we have go to wall.php file, and here we can see bootstrap panel class, skeleton, in this we will display particular user all followers list. First in this panel title class, we have write echo statement with dollar get data variable, with text followers, it will display particular user name here. Now we have go to header of this page, and here we have write user ID variable is equal to, get user ID function, with two argument like dollar connect variable, and dollar get data variable. This function, will return user ID based on value username get from dollar get data variable. Now we have go to database connection, and here we have create new function like get user ID with two argument like, dollar connect variable and dollar username variable. Under this function, we have write dollar query variable is equal to, select user ID from Twitter user table variable, where username is equal to, dollar username variable. Below this query, we have write dollar statement variable is equal to, dollar connect variable, with prepare statement and under this we have write dollar query variable. This statement will make query for execution, so for query execution, we have write dollar statement variable with execute method, it will execute query. After query execution, we have write dollar result variable is equal to, dollar statement variable with fetch all method, it will return query execution result. Below this, we have write for each loop, with condition like dollar result variable as dollar row variable. Under this loop, we have write return statement with dollar row user ID variable, it will return user ID, which is an output of this function. Now we have go to wall.php file. And here we have go to panel body class, and under this, we have write dollar followers query variable is equal to, select star from Twitter user table. Inner join follow table, on follow table dot receiver ID is equal to, Twitter user dot user, where follow table dot sender ID is equal to, dollar user id variable this query will return particular user followers list below this query we have write dollar statement variable is equal to dollar connect variable with prepare statement and under this we have write dollar follower query variable after this for query execution here we have write dollar statement variable with execute method, it will execute query. Now we have write dollar follower result variable is equal to dollar statement variable with fetch all method, it will return query execution result. Below this, we have write for each loop and under condition we have write dollar follower result variable as dollar follower row variable. Under this loop, 
we have write dollar profile image variable is equal to blank value. Under this variable, we will store particular user profile image. Now we have write if statement and under condition, we have write dollar follower row variable with profile image index is not equal to blank. If this condition true, that means user has set his or her profile image, so here we have write dollar profile image variable is equal to image tag with source attribute is equal to images folder slash dollar follower row profile image variable. But suppose above condition false, that means user has not profile image, it will execute else block of code, and here we have write dollar profile image variable is equal to image tag with source is equal to images slash user dot jpg image it will display default user image now we have write echo statement and here first paste html code in this first we want to display profile image so here we have write dollar profile image variable after this we want to display username, so here we have write anchor tag, with attribute ref is equal to, wall.php, question mark data is equal to, follower row username variable. Here we have make, particular user wall link, by click on this link. Login user can see all post of this user on single page. After list all followers of this user, now we want to make follow unfollow button of this user, so login user can follow this user also. So here we have write, if statement and under condition, we have write dollar user id variable value is not equal to dollar session user id variable this condition will check login user id is not same of this dollar user id variable if this condition true then it will execute if block of code and here we have write echo statement with make follow button function with three argument. In first argument, we have write dollar connect variable. In second argument, we have write dollar user ID variable. And third argument, we have write dollar session user ID variable. This function will make follow unfollow button of this user. This function we have already make in one of our previous tutorial in database connection.php file. So here our code is ready. Now we have check output in browser. Friends, this is login page. Now we have enter John Smith as username. And in password we have enter password. And login into John Smith account. Here we can see search bar on header of the page, now we have type something, the we have can see filter user list has been appear on web page, so now we have click on Jacob Martin username. After click on Jacob Martin username, then page has been redirect to wall.php question mark, data is equal to Jacob Martin. And here we can see all post of Jacob Martin on single page. With all post on single page, here we can also see all followers of Jacob Martin on this page also. Here we can also see follow unfollow button of Jacob Martin user also. By click on this followers, we can also go to that user all post also. And on this page, 
we can see all post with all followers of that user. So, this way we have add one more feature in this follow unfollow system, by using PHP with Ajax, if you have some other feature, please share in comment of this video, we will implement in this system. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.